traders, FS5 Collector here. Today is Thursday, September 12th, and I'm going to be analyzing the euro US dollar. Starting on the monthly, working my way all the way down to the one hour time frame for the full top down analysis. So, on the euro dollar monthly, I still think this is very, very likely to start making its way up for an expanding flat wave C or possibly a running flat wave C. These little blue boxes are my targets for depending on whether it's a running flat or an expanding flat. So let's take a look at it on the weekly time frame. On the weekly time frame, I think we're already in that wave 3 of this expanding flat. I think this is the end of a wave 2. I think this is all subdivisions, like a 1, this is a 2, and this is likely a wave 3 of wave 3. So, if that's true, then this move down is very, very likely to make a higher low, higher low, and continue to make those higher highs and higher lows in this wave 3 of either an expanding or a running flat wave C. So taking it down to the daily time frame, I'm definitely still looking for three-way pullbacks. I'm watching my Fibonacci levels very, very closely. I think at this point it's going to at least go down to the 50 and possibly even a little bit further before you actually do get that complete reversal and continuation of the uptrend. So taking it down to the four-hour time frame. On the four-hour time frame, my most recent structure is still way up here. So unless price goes all the way up there and breaks that structure right there, I'm definitely still only looking for shorts in a downtrend. I definitely don't think this ABC is over, so I'm definitely still on the short side. Going down to the one hour time frame. One hour time frame, I'm definitely looking for three waves up. I'm looking for one, two, three waves up. I'm looking for Fibonacci bounces. I'm looking for nice engulfing moves to the downside for more entries to go short. And the trend is down on the higher time frames. I believe this is still a wave C. I would target at least a 50% area and possibly even lower than that. So definitely still looking for three way pullbacks and golfing moves to the downside, which that is looking pretty interesting right there as we are speaking. So, anyways, definitely don't forget to check out my free Discord channel, which is linked over here in the corner. And as always, thank you, and happy trading.